going to look at how to convert your references into proper Harvard referencing. So you can see on the student's work, she's simply copied and pasted the URL for the website. So what we're going to do is to copy this URL. We're going to paste it into the website. Crap. So we find the website where she got it from and we paste in the URL. So it came from environmental permits. So what we're going to do is copy the title of the web page and go back to her document. We're then going to go to references. So that's at the menu at the top. When you click references, can you then click manage sources? And we're going to put a new reference in. So click new. We then paste the uh, the name of the web page, OK, and then you go back, so we'll just say OK to, to that for now, and close. We then go, need to go get the URL, so we'll copy the URL, go back to manage sources, and we'll edit this one. So we'll now put in the URL. We now need to put in the author. So we need to go and find the author. Go back to the web page. And this was written by .go.uk. So we'll copy that. And go back to your document. So we'll edit it again. Now the important thing is to say the name of the website and the year it was published. You don't need to put all of this information in, but you can call that a corporate author because it's not a person. We then enter that into your bibliography and say OK, change everything, close. And what we can do is at the bottom of the document, we can now insert the proper bibliography by clicking bibliography. And there we go. And that's the start of bibliography. The next thing you'll need to do is to insert the citation. So she used this to get to. What we need to do next is to link the bibliography to the text. So we now insert what's called a citation. So I'm assuming that she got this information from quality control. So if we click on quality control, insert citation, click that, and it tells her, tells us where she got the information from. What you can do is you can add to your references as you go along. So we can now take out this, and she's got a beautiful bibliography at the bottom.